you know, I think when you're dealing with the building that's over 100 years old, accessibility is something that they didn't they didn't build into the facility back then. And uh, we have a beautiful historical building and finding a way that we can accommodate accessibility but still keep the historical integrity of the building is really important to us. So you'll see we have started the construction on the side of our building. The goal was not to have a giant uh, or a ramp in the front that would sort of take away from the historical integrity of the building, but we have a very uh, practical solution to come into the side of the building. And then once you're in the building, of course, it doesn't mean anything if your counter space and your staff isn't accessible to people. So we also are rebuilding uh, counter top that can have people come directly from that ramp into the building and come forward and have an accessible space so they can be served by our friendly staff. So we have, of course, uh, accessibility to our main floor that will include the construction of accessible bathroom for the public, which I think is important. And then, of course, long term, uh, we are in a building that we are looking at options to provide access to the second floor, which I think is very important. We have to find a way that is fiscally responsible to do so and also very practical while working with a building that, again, is over 100 years old. Yeah, we are definitely looking at a lift system. We just have to find a way to incorporate in our building that can be done, again, fiscally responsible way in a practical way, but there's definitely some interesting ideas coming forward and we will be looking at that through our next budgetary process. And because accessibility is a national and provincial priority as well as locally, we're always looking for grants to potentially partner with to allow that accessibility to the second floor because it will be an expensive endeavor. So this will be finished in the spring of the new year. Uh, so we're doing a lot of the internal work right now, uh, but obviously uh, during the winter time, we'll have to wait to the spring before we can actually construct the physical ramp. We're just very excited for this project. It's been on the agenda for previous council and so nice to be seeing it done. Accessibility is important and I do believe that we as the city need to be a leader in things. And so once we have an accessible space, it's easier for us to encourage businesses and facilities around our community to do the same. I have a friend who cannot access our building right now and I'm excited because I have a standing date for coffee once this building's accessible and he'll be coming here as soon as he can.